Welcome guys. Today I'm going to show you how to make a spiced rum stout flip. I've seen a lot of stout flips uh, when browsing through Reddit lately. Thought I'd give it a crack. I have made flips in the past. I'll link to one of them up here. I believe that was either a spice rum or a, it was a rum flip of some, some description. That one was wicked, really, really tasty. So I'm excited to incorporate a stout into it. Uh, this is actually a, a, a porter. So there's a difference between a porter and a stout. I believe a stout is gonna add more uh, chocolate, toffee and uh, coffee kind of notes to it. Uh, so that's another reason why I'm, I'm using a spice rum. So it's gonna replace some of those flavors that would have come from a, a different, more intense stout. I'll leave some information in the description below so you can read up about the difference between porter and stout. And also big thank you to the team from Untold for sending this bottle my way so I could utilize it in a few recipes. So start by measuring out 90 mils of your stout, or in my case, porter. I'm just estimating, I'd say that's close enough. good so 90 mils three ounces of your stout followed by two ounces 60 mils of your spiced rum now of course you can use a bourbon whiskey a rum what have you whatever you've got lying around in your in your whiskey or in your spirit cabinet should I say and then last ingredient second to last ingredient is sugar so this is a one-to-one -one sugar syrup three quarters 22.5 mils and then a whole egg so a lot of people are quite funny about eggs but as long as it's fresh it should be good make sure you use fresh eggs though so start by dry shaking dry shaking is simply shaking without ice emulsify the egg then wet shake the cocktail with your stout as well it's probably a good idea not to crack it open and pour it straight in uh, because it is carbonated, so it's going to go e everywhere quite easily. But now wet shake the cocktail. Now, I definitely haven't judged this very well because I can see already that this glass is going to be way too tiny for this particular drink. Strain it into your chilled stemmed cocktail glass. and garnish with freshly grated nutmeg. So there you have a spice rum stout flip. Cheers. It's very like eggnog-esque. Eggnog really nice texture, real thick, creamy. Get a lot of spices, quite rich. Such a simple drink and so much depth of flavor. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you soon for another cocktail video. Cheers.